to fire. Here the divine spark of consciousness ignites the fires of our will to burn through resistance and vitalize the entire system. Pulsating flames of energy enliven us to awaken our power, to burn with purpose, to strengthen our will. We keep that flame alive through all its trials and tribulations as we burn through blocks into ever greater freedom and power. Lest that fire burn itself out, that power must be tamed. Through diligent practice, we unite the energies within and around us no small task as we follow the chaotic and fiery serpent of Kundalini, harnessing her energy to bring it into our bellies and blossom forth with power. This fire carries and sustains us as we burn through the ego and dissolve into the lustrous gem that is the true source of power in Manipura. Leaving the third chakra ignited we rise again to the heart to find a green lotus of 12 petals called anahata, meaning unstruck or unhurt. The element of this chakra is air as we rise up into the softness and spaciousness of the sky. Now the Kundalini Serpent carries us upwards on wings of love to embrace the awakening of Divine Spirit which bids the heart to open and fly free. Expanding into the element air with each breath we take, we soar towards the infinite, becoming light and spacious within. Dancing playfully with another, we enter the mystery of love and relationship as we transcend ego and journey with others into the divine realm of the heart. Uniting heaven and earth, masculine and feminine, mind and body in perfect balance the heart is a soft place, tender, deep, a place of compassion and connection. When awakened, the heart beats with the rhythm of life, pulsing its love through all our relations, self and other, culture and planet, human and divine. As we open our own hearts, we tune into the global heart, now dawning at the frontiers of social awareness. From the balance of the heart, we now move into the blue lotus of 16 petals located in the throat called Vishuddha, which means purification. Eo, 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 eo. 
In the etheric realm of the throat chakra, Kundalini awakens the core vibrations within as sound carried on the air of our breath opens our expression to the music of the stars. Listen to the murmur of the voice within. Listen to the song rising out of your heart. Primordial Om, vibration ripples through all of creation, resonating, expressing, harmonizing, synchronizing, opening our voices to sing our truth into the chorus of life. Self-expression flows in waves of vibration, taking us deeper and yet deeper to the truth we hold within and the truth we find without. From essence into vibration, to sound, to language, communication, and expressions of creativity. Transferring music, knowledge, and poetry through time. As the fifth chakra vibrates within the throat, we move up to the brow chakra, a lotus of only two petals called Ashna which means to perceive and to command. Kundalini is now a glowing serpent of light, uncoiling from the depths of our meditation to open chakra six, the third eye, center of vision, insight, and the limitless world of light. The two petals of this chakra bring resolution of duality to the single-pointed focus of the third eye. 